Y'all make welcome Mr. Ryan Joseph over here singing that high. high, high, high. Well, it was a mighty fine job. Mr. John Meyer over here singing the airplane. Mr. Billy James bringing up the bass back here in the back. Some of y'all may, may have seen uh, Billy James back here. He played for the Staff Brothers years ago. Before I came on, he played for the Staff Brothers. Bass was in for a lot of years. And so uh, when this, he retired, actually from music for a while. And I actually talked him back into coming back on the road, and I'm so glad I did because he's like my best friend in the whole world. Right. Right here. And I still don't want to know how to where you can sing that high and talk as low as you do. It's for you, Jim. <laughs> I, I had a girl that sang for me for five years, and it was Sydney Curry, and uh, Miss Curry Underwood came along and sold her from me. You know, she, I told her, you know, she, I hadn't really talked her into it, you know. I said, go on over and play with Gary. You know, I know you got to take a little pay cut, but go on over there and play with Gary. <laughs> so she did, but I'll tell you what, I think I got a great replacement here. I'm going to give Dr. Steve Dress on to the stage up here. Right? Y'all may have seen him. He plays with a guy named by the name of Mr. Alan Jackson, so y'all seen him. Yeah. 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 And I'm proud to have these guys, proud to share the stage with them. They're some of the finest young men that uh, you'll ever, and yes, you too did, but one of the finest young men that you'll ever know in your life. But uh, anyway, I'm going to take you back to Virginia. I grew up up there, uh, not too far from where the South Bills grew up. Uh, if you saw the Walton's TV show, you pretty much saw how I grew up. And um, I, I got to do the uh, work to L.A. about four, about four or five years ago, as it was now. And I did the... Um, uh, 40th reunion of the Walton's TV show out there and got to know um, uh, a lot of the cast and everything. Of course, I was a good friends with Earl Hammer, who's the writer and creator of the Walton's. And we used to talk a lot about my family versus his family. Now, our family was a lot like his family. I'm number, number seven of nine children. And my daddy did go broke making fortunes. <laughs> I, I know, I, t I told Earl then, he got the biggest kick out of it. Anyway, Earl passed away a couple of years ago. He was 92 years old, and I miss him very much. But I remember telling him about my mom and daddy. I, I wanted to write a song for them because they were so, uh, such a wonderful mom and dad. Spent a lot of time praying for us kids, especially number seven. I needed all the help I could get along with so, Just some simple words to say thank you to a mom and daddy who prayed for me. Thank you. 